guys, let's talk about the 10 stroke roll. 10 stroke roll is pretty simple in a nutshell. You just simply, it, the first way to approach it is um, you play a nine stroke roll and then just add one more note on the end. Here's a nine stroke roll. Ah. Then your 10 stroke roll. Add one more. Nine stroke roll. 10 stroke roll. Do it on the left side. Nine stroke roll. 10 stroke roll. The other way to approach it is in triplets. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, right? You notice I'm keeping the middle down. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now we put double strokes in the middle to make it a 10 stroke roll. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, right? So you play that up to speed. Right? That makes me think of, um, there's a snare drum solo called the Three Camps. It kind of just goes like, right? It goes on and on. There's a middle section with 10 stroke rolls. And so forth, right? That's a little sloppy, but um, otherwise, you know, 10 stroke roll, lots of rudiment, a lot of, um, a lot of snare drum application, a lot of drum set application, great for playing in a shuffle, great for, great for playing in jazz, uh, anything kind of bouncy, yeah, it really fits, fits the bill. Um, yeah, so you want to get to work on that one. Make sure you don't rush the two taps at the end. You don't want this, you don't want this here. You want, or triplets. Great rudiment to know. You should get on it right away. Okay, hey guys, thanks a lot for watching the video. We'll see you in the next video with uh, lots of playing examples. And um, take care, practice hard. We'll see you soon.